Hi, my name is Krista Bauer. Today we had the pleasure of having Dr. John Mighton in our school and in my classroom, and it was phenomenal. Uh, the kids were so engaged, and he had 40 children basically eating out of the palm of his hand. And the thing I took away is that he built their confidence. He started with their confidence, and then he grew it from that. His anxiety is going to be a roadblock to learning, particularly in math. There's a lot of anxiety around it, and we're trying to break that down in our classrooms. And anything I can do to make my students feel more comfortable, I'm willing to try it. My take-home message is uh, use as many tools and tricks that you can to break down the anxiety. and. Um, Start with confidence building units that, you know, Jump provides. I'm going to relook at those again. And um, another message I got was have the kids write about uh, their anxiety before they do a quiz. So we'll see what we can do with that. So I'm always happy to try something new. Uh, I'm a grade six teacher at an English public school in Quebec City, so I wanted to uh, learn the latest research that's happening in math, and particularly jump math. Well, it's, you're, you're giving a, a wonderful opportunity to see the type of evidence uh, in the research that's happening with the brain, with uh, children's learning, how it applies to both math and reading, to much my surprise today, um, and how that impacts, along with the teacher attitude, uh, and competence in teaching math at the school level. Well, one of the things that impacted me this morning was uh, the, the fact that math anxiety has such an impact on students. And one little simple technique that we were given to take home immediately was to have students write about their anxiety before beginning their math test or uh, problems. That seems to be uh, proven that that helps them learn and be ready to learn right away. I see it uh, more with the girls than the boys. Um, however, if, we can, if I can relieve that component, I use a lot of humor in my class. However, now knowing something extra that I can use is going to help a whole lot more. And I have used jump math before, and I've seen the difference it can make in a child's life and their ability not just to uh, find that I don't, I'm not good at math, they suddenly begin to love math with, because they experience success all the way through. I've seen the difference that jump math makes in kids actually believing in themselves and giving them the confidence that they need to, uh, to love math. And I always want to position it as they get to make their choices in life, not someone else. Math opens up a whole new world for them.